Yo, what's happening? What it do, my people? So, this is the end of the year. This is my last list. I've been putting lists list together for 2019. This is my last list. And I've been seeing a lot of people list, man. And people, y'all list been incredible and stuff. So, me, I'm second guessing my list and stuff. I'm like, I'm like, man, people list, they got that heat and stuff. I'm like, man, my little list, I'm like, ah. Oh. I don't even know if I want to do this because my little sneaker collection, I'm thinking about things I got in 2019 and stuff. I'm like, huh, it ain't all that. But then looking at the stuff, I'm like, I'm like, man, my stuff is just as worthy as the next. I'm like, I got them for a reason because I liked them. So I'm just sharing with y'all which pickups were my favorites of 2019 and stuff, man. Try to go through this as fast as possible. I'm going to start off with honorable mentions. So here you go. First honorable mention. Jordan 11 Platinum Tints. I got these for a cheap price, I think, on uh, maybe eBay or something. But I like them. I like them, man. It's, it's not one of my favorites, but I, I try to collect 11s. And just because just it was a cheap price, I had to grab them. So I'm going to try to move through this quick as possible, especially the honorable mentions. So next honorable mention, these Jordan 33s. I had these on foot today, so I'm like, uh. And then I looked at, at my playlist of uh, my videos and I was like, oh, I got these in January. So this, this is a 2019 release. Uh, I mean, I'm, well, not a 2019 release, but I picked them up in 2019. So I'm happy with, the, with these right here, man. A good hoop and shoot. And that's something I noticed about my stuff where I was kind of like weary of my list and stuff. I'm like, man, people got off-white and Yeezys and all this, man. I'm like, my stuff is like I'm a college basketball player, man. I'm just hooping. Now these right here, this ain't this ain't the most heat in the world, man. I seen these on Nike. I think I had like a percentage off or a coupon or something, and I liked them, so I got them. But I paid too much. I paid maybe like 120 or something. You probably could get these for a pork chop sandwich now. But I liked them, man. And as you can see, shit, they barely worn. I wore them like two times. You wasting money, but then uh, these right here, this is an honorable mention. This one of a grail pickup and stuff, but it's something I got off. I think eBay for like thirty some dollars. Nobody wasn't bidding on it. Like they don't have nothing wrong with them or anything. Just didn't come with a box, but got like thirty some dollars. So being that I got them for so cheap, I don't really uh, I don't know. I don't really cherish them that much. I'm like, ah, these little cheap ass shoes, even though they. It's a two hundred dollar shoe, but I don't know. Somebody else threw them away. So when I got them, it's just like, ah, this ain't that. This right here is something, but it's still in the honorable mentions. These trophy room sixteens, man. Yeah, been liking these, man. When DJ Khaled and he was talking about these and stuff, whenever they dropped, been wanting a pair, man. I think I mm, think maybe more carry. I might have got them off Mercari. Mercari off or eBay or something. Probably Mercari. And uh didn't come with the guy with the damn box and stuff. But other than that, she was a pristine shoe. They just got some crease on the on the toe and stuff. But happy to have that in the collection. And the last honorable mention. I'm just I'm just stunned. I'm just stunned, man. That's why I'm just I'm just trying to show a lot of stuff. They still got a lot of things that I haven't shown that I'm not gonna show. It's just not not worth mentioning, but yeah, I'm just I'm just stunned. I think that's what we all do. We all just stun at the end of the year. This is what I got. <laughs> so, the win like 82. I hate to say my age and stuff, man. I was born at 82. This the year whenever Jordan hit the game winning shot. And it was in New Orleans. I'm not from New Orleans, but I'm from Louisiana. So 82 happened in Louisiana. Game winning shot against Georgetown. Jordan 11s, one of my favorite silhouettes, had to throw these up in the collection. Very happy to have these, man. I wanted these when they came out, but no way I was paying two something, or did I have two something at the time when these came out. So glad to get these later on for a cheap price, man, like $100 or something, I think. But to the main event, the top 10, it started off. Start off with LeBron 15s, and I love this silhouette, man. I love these shoes, and I had been wanting these. I got them like maybe in the middle of this year, 
like they had been out for a while, but I I just like the the play on them, man. That black and that white shoe, the quality joints, man. I just I just really did like this shoe, and since I wanted it so bad, and I did eventually get it, that's why I put this on the list, man. Uh, buy what you like. Ten. These came in the other day. The other day, man. I still, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do an individual video on these. But something I'm happy to throw throw in the collection, man. This is something that, that's kind of new in the, in the uh, shoe shoe verse. Came out in October and stuff. But uh, I'm happy to have these 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 the pond whatever joints, the pond whatever whatever that means to you. But people don't don't like the shininess and stuff. It's the backboard look it looks like shattered glass or whatever that's what it's supposed to be they don't they're not the best shoe when you look at them like this but on feet with certain outfits on or something they look crazy so number nine you shattered bad boy 3.0s damn these things are light and these they are light they are light 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 Ooh, i like these man i like these jordan 34s Zion, sign with him. He still ain't played for the Pelicans. I wanted to go to New Orleans to try to watch him, but he don't want to play. But Carmelo is back. These the ones Carmelo played in these a lot. So I think of these as the Carmelos. In light shoe technology on them is great. You can look through them joints. This definitely a dope hooping shoe. I played in a tournament. I got these like a day or two after I played in the tournament. Man, I wish I would have had these shoes to play in that tournament, man. I would have loved to play in these. So, I'm at number eight. So, birthday pickup. Wow. Got these, had a coupon. So, jumped on. I don't even think I got to use my coupon on these. Yeah, I did. Well, I, I got, had a gift card. But I had a birthday coupon. I wasn't able to use the coupon as well. Because Jordan, well, Nike won't let you use like a coupon, like 20% off coupon on Jordan stuff. I was very perturbed. But got these, man. I'm from the boot. I'm from Louisiana, from the country. Camo. You, camo. I'm surrounded by grass. It's not New York or nothing. We ain't got a concrete jungle. It's grass and mosquitoes and stuff. If I need to run from the poke holes, I'm wearing these. So. Love these right here. These AI Legacy joints. And this, I think, was a 2019 release, man. I got these for like, like 30 something dollars, man. Brand new. Ah, oh, these are dope. These are dope right here. No, I think I, I think I might have got these maybe $60. And then a week later, I got the white and black ones for like $30. That's why I got the white and black ones, just because they were so cheap. But uh I love this colorway. I see me and my kicks here drop them uh them, them LeBron threes in this same colorway, and this colorway is just beautiful. And man, I seen and Iverson is my favorite player, and they had this colorway. I was like, man, I had I had to cop. I did get them LeBron threes too. I bought them this morning. But, uh, that's that's the, another another time, another time, another place. You could be. <laughs> but uh, had to had to mention these, man. Coming through, Jordan 12, them, them blue joints. I think these like some Nipsey Hustles. These are these like some Nipsey's, man. It's just uh, the, the Crip, the Crip joints, man. But I like these. I like these. I always wanted the flu games. I never got the flu games. So I was like, man, this is a, a good substitute. And the thing about them is that I bought these in... The beginning of October, I think I got them like the, the day they dropped, and then I was waiting like three, four days. I was waiting for my tracking information, and then the place I got them from, maybe DTL or or something, or Foot up, Foot Locker or something, they sent me an email saying we can't complete your order, and so they reimbursed me, and so I didn't get these. So later on, I'm doing my shoe reviews and stuff, and the company sent me these for a review, 
So that's how I end up with these in my hands. So I didn't pay nothing for them. So appreciate it. Why are these way down at number four? Cause they were Ponda River, Ponda River. <laughs> but uh, got these. Company sent me these for a sneaker review. So hey, and I won. In for anybody, if y'all want to talk noise, like if you do like one shoe or something from Ponda River, Ponda River, they like man, your whole sneaker collection is fugazi or whatever. Man, I don't care. My my sneaker collection, ninety percent. Stuff I came out of my pocket and went by and stuff and shit. If somebody's gonna send me something for free for doing something that I love, I'm gonna review them things. I'm gonna review them things and I'm gonna keep them or I'm gonna I'm, I'm, not, I'm not gonna flip them. I'm not gonna flip them. Mm -mm. But uh shit got these and I'm happy to have these in the collection. These are dope. No, I can't afford the other one. I can't pay a thousand dollars for a shoe. No, no, no. In the, the quality on these the, the leather quality everything everything is pristine on here they got the cactus jack and you see all the the bells and whistles and, and stuff on here the suede everything on here is clean and i wore these in foot locker in the mall and stuff and ain't nobody saying nothing to me Shit. oh well number three number three all three of y'all This shoe is special to me. This is a birthday day pickup. Uh, shout out to uh, to uh, JJ all day, man. Uh, subscribe to the brother. But he gifted this to me, man, for a brother birthday. And man, so I didn't get nothing for my birthday. I didn't get nothing for Christmas or nothing, but he gifted me these, man. This really made my birthday extra special. Well, I did get these for my birthday, but I paid for them myself. But uh, got these. And love these. I wear these. I've worn these like every uh about every Saturday with L for LSU games. And LSU has made it to the national championship. And I will wear these for the championship game. And we are undefeated. And look like we might might bring it home. Homeboy got the Heisman. So these these are the Lakers, but I represent them for LSU. It's the, the LSU colorway. This was my steal of the year right here. Space Jams. And these are the Space Jams with the 4-5. And I wanted these when they dropped. I ain't had the bread for them. But I waited. Patience pays off sometimes. And I think I got I think I got at least like 80 bucks, man. Like $80, real talk, on like eBay. I was looking, I had a lot of them like in my watch list. And these people just slept on them. They just didn't bid on them. And I bid it at the last second and I won. And I was like, I won these for $80. And they have the paperwork, everything on them. Like these are, these ain't Fugazi or anything like that. And got these for that price. I'm like, wow. And so I love that. I love the packaging. They got the stars and stuff on there. This, this is just a dope shoe. Dope shoe. So moving on to my number one, one, one. Number one pickup of the year. I'm, I'm gonna be honest with you. Uh, I had the bread 11s. I had a company that sent them to me earlier, in the, but I ended up getting rid of them. Cause I was like, I was like, I'm gonna get them. I'm gonna get them in December. And then, like, I had the paper, but it just it was tied up. It was tied up at the moment. I had things to take care of. And then I was like, at last second, I was like, should I get these shoes? I was like, but I got Christmas stuff to get. And so instead of being selfish. And like getting those for myself, I end up buying other people's stuff for Christmas. So I didn't get the bread 11s. I was like, man, I might, maybe you'll get them later on in, in life or whatever. Uh, they had a lot of pairs, so I'm pretty sure I can get a pair at another point in time, but I didn't get them. But I'm happy to get these. My favorite player of all time, I don't, you can't see it, but it's up there Allen Iverson, the answer. Bubba Chuck, whatever you want to call him. Got these. And I got these the other day. Shit, $79.99. These was complex kind and stuff. 
uh, Eric Emmanuel. Uh, they came out. They were high price at first and stuff. They have other ones. They have the white and pink ones, and they have the the ice cream ones and stuff. And they go for a pretty penny. These are dropping in price and stuff. But just being my favorite player, that's number one. I wanted the yellow pair of shoes bad. I didn't have any yellow pair of shoes in my collection. So that's two. I finally I got my yellow pair of shoes that I needed. And number three, man, the, the quality on these joints, like, say what you want about Reebok, and Reebok fell off and this and that. Man, when Reebok put out some, some stuff, Reebok, they put their foot in it. Like, they quality, they quality control or whatever, whatever, whatever uh, factories they using overseas or something, man, that factory and stuff, they are great. Maybe it's because the fact they probably don't make as many shoes as like Jordan and them. Like Jordan probably make way more shoes, so they have to stretch stretch out their materials and stuff, so they don't make as many, so they can use better materials. Maybe that's it, but the materials on here are plush grand and they still got the tag on them i will be wearing these though but i don't, I don't think i'm gonna wear them much this is more of an art piece and a collectible item but i will wear them i will wear these out but that is my number one pickup of 2019 man in 2020 maybe go less on the basketball vibes get some more life life shoes and stuff man try to mature a little bit Shit, I don't know if I'm going to get more shoes or I'm going to get less shoes. Because I, I want to save money, but then they got stuff I want. So I don't I don't know. We'll see what 2020 brings, man. I, I reached a couple milestones. I reached 2,000 subscribers this year. I reached 2,500 subscribers. I'm on the road to 3,000. Hopefully, my, my big goal, I would love to reach 10,000 in 2020. But realistically... I maybe can get to 5,000, so that is maybe a more realistic goal, but I want to reach 10. I want to reach 10, man, because once your subscribers start getting up to a certain level, then it, you, it gets, start getting higher. The higher you get, the faster they come in. So if you got 100,000 subscribers, man, then people will start getting there faster, but I'm, I'm far from that. I'm far from that and stuff, and I might be... I might be uh, looking stupid. You might, you don't know what you're talking about. But uh, that's just my theories and stuff. But like, comment, subscribe to be the greatest of the most hated man. Hope that you uh, enjoyed this video. You endured on my long windedness, and hopefully you like the collection. Don't come rob me. Peace.